Hi guys, Adam here, and welcome back to another video in M's Toyland. And this is the second part of me showcasing every species in my makeshift Jurassic World in my pocket office. <laughs> and I'm going to be joined by Mini Barbs. What up, Jogger Peeps? Hi, Jogger Peeps. Haha. <laughs> and I'm also going to be joined by Kwamis. <laughs> More specifically, the Kwamis of Tiki, Trix, Plag, <laughs> Bark, and, well, Waze, and Pollen. <laughs> and all of these guys are going to help me showcase the new dinosaurs that <laughs> I recently got for my makeshift to Jurassic World. Let's go. All right, Plag. <laughs> Before we move on to the new dinosaurs and flying reptile that I got for the park, <laughs> how about you recap the species that were in the last part, or the previous part. <laughs> so my viewers out there get a quick recap. Alright, so the species that were in the last part were Tyrannosaurus rex, Velociraptor, Spinosaurus Indominus rex, Parasaurolophus, Therizinosaurus, and Mosasaurus. Thanks, Plague. No problem. Uh, can I have some camembert? Ugh, Plague. I'm gonna give you some camembert <laughs> after we film today's video. Okay, see, sounds like a good deal to me. Good. Hey, I heard that! No, you didn't, Plague. <laughs> I've never been in this type of video before. I think this might be fun. <laughs> I think it might be fun too, Teak. <laughs> I like that nickname. Okay, uh, let's go get the new species for the park. Oh, right. Thanks for reminding me, Bark. You're welcome. I'll actually get them for you. <laughs> Thanks, Bark. Hey, can I help too? Sure, ways. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Yeah, I think Bark and Waze can <laughs> handle themselves. I'm sure you're right, Trix. They're, at least they're not like Plague. Hey, I heard that. Uh, Plague. Trix, well, <laughs> Bark and Waze <laughs> are more responsible than you to get anything around here. Oh, come on, sugar cube. It's kind of true, Plague. Uh, fine. Hey, Adam, we're done. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Thanks, Bark. Thanks, Lace. No problem. All right, so. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Bark. Do you and Way Do you and Ways want to introduce the new species for the park? Sure. Since we got them. All right, so <laughs> let's go biggest, smallest. So the first species that we got for the park is the Brachiosaurus, <laughs> a Baryonyx, the Jurassic Park three male Velociraptor, <laughs> the Ankylosaurus, Sinoceratops, Corythosaurus, and the smallest creature that we have today is the Sun Gratigus. <laughs> All right, thanks, you two. <laughs> Let's get everyone to, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> feature one of the species, one of the new species for the park. Sounds good. Yep, sounds good, Adam. All right, so <laughs> the first dinosaur I'm going to be <laughs> showcasing in this. Second part of this two video series <laughs> is the Corythosaurus. And the reason why my Corythosaurus is like this is because it can't really stand up very well. I don't know how it could stand up when I featured it for the first time in its introductory video, but what else? In this segment, I'm going to be <laughs> joined by Mini Barbs. All right, Jug Peeps, let's get, <laughs> let's get 
a, let's take a look at this Corythosaurus. All right, so, <laughs> the color scheme is white, black, yellow, and red. <laughs> nice. And this species of dinosaur is a had, <laughs> this Corythosaurus is actually in the Hadrosaur family. <laughs> yep. And the reason why it looks like <laughs> how the how it looks in Jurassic Park 3 is because this is a Hammond Collection Corythosaurus. And to watch the full entire video, <laughs> go check out my <laughs> Corythosaurus Hammond Collection video <laughs> when I <laughs> introduce this dinosaur. Alright, so I think that's it for me, let's move on to the next dinosaur. All right, sounds good, mini barbs. All right, up next in this update, <laughs> well, in the second episode, is the Somnogryphagus, the first and only flying reptile in this video. <laughs> and I'm going to <laughs> be joined by Plague in this segment. Hey guys, so, uh, this is a really unique looking flying reptile. <laughs> uh, why isn't it flying? Plague, you're holding on to it. Oh, right. <laughs> Plague, do not use your cataclysm on it. I am not going to use my cataclysm on me. Come on! <laughs> um, alright, so, <laughs> yeah, this Sundagrypticus is brown, yellow, <laughs> Blue and <laughs> a light brown color. Cool. Oh, and this <laughs> whitish color. Yep. And <laughs> it's a very unique looking one. <laughs> I would love to <laughs> race it. <laughs> like how fast it flies. I think I will... <laughs> Yeah, I think I will win. <laughs> and all of these species that are in this video <laughs> uh, do have their own videos on this channel already. <laughs> Just a heads up. Yep, thanks, Plag. <laughs> well, that's the Car I mean, not the Carithosaurus, the Sundagrypticus. Uh-oh, I think it's gonna get us. I'm out of here. Ah! Flag! You shouldn't have been holding on to its foot. Oh boy. Uh, now you tell me. Okay, so the next species I'm going to be showing you is the Brachiosaurus. And it's the biggest creature in the entire park. And I'm going to be joined by Waze in this segment. Hey guys. <laughs> wow. It kind of looks like a giraffe, kind of. Well, Waze, <laughs> the Brachiosaurus is actually known as the Giraffe of the Cretaceous Period. Mmm, that's a really fitting nickname for it. Yep, it is, sure is, Waze. All right. So its color scheme is dark brown, light brown, and a little bit of blue near the start of the neck and on the top of the head. Cool. <laughs> and <laughs> I think if Plag were here, he would probably try to ride it or something. Waze, I would love to ride that Brachiosaurus. Uh, see what I mean? <laughs> well, good thing Plag isn't in the segment with me or he'll be able or or else he would try to cataclysm this Brachiosaurus, or ride it, or who who knows what he'll try to do with it. Well, I think that's the Brachiosaurus. <laughs> yep, that's the Brachiosaurus. Yep. <laughs> that's the end of this part. See you, wait. See you, ways. Bye. Thanks for helping me in that segment. No problem. All right, the next species that I'm going to be showing you is... The Baryonyx, and Tiki's going to be in this scene with me. Hi, Adam. Ah! Not that Baryonyx again. Uh, I don't think. 
I think it remembers me. Ah! Okay, let's do that segment quick. <laughs> so, this Baryonyx is actually <laughs> the one that appeared in Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. <laughs> and it actually looks like the model <laughs> in Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. is, And that is because that... Just like the Corythosaurus that I <laughs> featured first in this video, <laughs> this is actually a Hammond Collection Baryonyx. <laughs> and <laughs> it's not just the movies that, it's not that, it's not just the Jurassic movies that have the Baryonyx. <laughs> the canonical spin-off show, Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous, has the <laughs> has the Baryonyx as well. <laughs> and the Baryonyx's color scheme is brown, dark blue, and white. Yep, and there's a little bit of light blue in the face. <laughs> All right. That's the Baryonyx. Ah! Oh boy, I think it does remember Tiki. Oh boy, look out, Tiki! All right, so the next species I'm going to be showing you is the Ankylosaurus. <laughs> All right, so in this segment, I'm actually going to be joined by Pollen. Hi, guys. All right, so the Ankylosaurus <laughs> has a brown color scheme mostly and <laughs> a <laughs> the spikes on its back are white. <laughs> and... <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> this dinosaur is r like a living tank, <laughs> and that's actually how Gunnar Eversall actually described the Ankylosaurus in Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. Yep, and this is actually the Jurassic World Dominion toy of the Ankylosaurus. Well, <laughs> the Ankylosaurus, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the Jurassic World Dominion version of this dinosaur. All right, so I'm pretty sure that when you get this tail, when you get this tail moving, <laughs> the Syncalosaurus makes noise. <laughs> yep. <laughs> uh, Pollen, be careful around that tail. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> it's not just... <laughs> Jurassic World Dominion that has the Ankylosaurus, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous, Jurassic Park 3, Jurassic World. Yeah, I think that's it. Cool. <laughs> All right, that is the Ankylosaurus. <laughs> Bye. Later, Pollen. Thanks for <laughs> helping me in that segment. No problem. All right, so here's the <laughs> second to last species of this video. <laughs> yep, and <laughs> it's the Jurassic Park 3 male velociraptor. <laughs> and I'm going to be joined by Trix in this video. I mean, segment. <laughs> Hi, Adam. How you doing, Trix? Good. <laughs> so this <laughs> velociraptor looks how it does in Jurassic Park 3 um, well, <laughs> sort of. <laughs> the eyes of the male velociraptor <laughs> in Jurassic Park 3 are is red. <laughs> the eye color of the velociraptor males are red in Jurassic Park 3. But in this toy, <laughs> they're like an orangey color. Kind of like me. <laughs> well, that's okay. Exactly, Trix. <laughs> All right, so... The Velociraptor is actually, this Velociraptor is actually, yeah. <laughs> Not this particular Velociraptor, but Velociraptor is actually returning from the last <laughs> episode of this, well, video, <laughs> where I <laughs> showcase every dinosaur, flying reptile, and marine reptile in my makeshift Jurassic World <laughs> part. Yep. Cool. <laughs> and the color scheme, well, I don't think we can, well, I don't think we need to <laughs> give a color scheme because I think the video where this is showcased 
already goes into the color scheme. Exactly, Trix. <laughs> ha! <laughs> this is one cool Velociraptor. Yep. And the Velociraptor is actually my second favorite dinosaur in the Jurassic Park franchise. If you have seen my top 10 most favorite Jurassic Park dinosaurs list, <laughs> find it on you can find that on my channel and this Velociraptor's introductory video on my channel as well. Alright, Trix, thanks for helping me in that segment. No problem, madam. Later, guys. That's the Jurassic Park 3 male Velociraptor. The last species that I'm going to be <laughs> showcasing in this video is the Sinoceratops. <laughs> and I'm going to be joined by Bark in this <laughs> segment. Hi! <laughs> How you doing? Good, Bark. How are you? I'm good. Alright, so, this is actually a Ceratopsian, like, <laughs> yep, this is a cool Ceratopsian. It sure is, Bark. <laughs> yep. So, this is actually the Jurassic Park, no, not Jurassic Park, but, <laughs> this is actually the, <laughs> Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous version of the dinosaur. <laughs> because, yeah, the Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom toy of the Cenoceratops looks like a Pachybinosaurus because I'm pretty sure <laughs> the, the Cenoceratops was originally supposed to be a <laughs> Pachybinosaurus when Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom was being, <laughs> yeah, being developed. Nice! <laughs> and <laughs> this appears in a lot. <laughs> this bit appears big time in the first season of Jurassic World Camp Cretaceous. And throughout the show, too. <laughs> yep. And I think, <laughs> I hope that the Triceratops appears in its sequel series, Chaos Theory, which is coming out next month. <laughs> yeah, I hope it does too, Vark. <laughs> yep, and... <laughs> This color scheme is like pretty basic, like mostly blue, like with a peachy color, like a light peachy color and yellow and orange thrown in there too. Cool. <laughs> yep. So I think that's all the species that is that we're going to be doing in this video. So yeah, thanks for helping me in that segment bark no problem bye later bark <laughs> all right that was the Cenoceratops. i hope you enjoyed that video please click the like button down below and to subscribe click on the picture of venom fling the dilophosaurus to subscribe to this channel oh one more thing stay loving my makeshift jurassic world in my pocket office and jurassic world in general see you later bye See you later. Bye. <laughs> later. See you later. Adam, can I have my camera there now? Sure, I'll give it to you when we stop filming. Okay. I hope I don't run into that baryonyx again. Don't worry, Teak. I don't think you have anything to worry about. Okay. <laughs>